Classy Mike Trash, Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. And I'm reading for the Gravekeeper. Hey, what did I say earlier? Let me help. I do it every day, kid. Come on. It is that... Why do you do this helping? I went through this with your brother, kid. Not with me. <sighs> I guess so. Folks needed it. Yeah, the ones going in the graves, but the ones carrying them needed it more. And I like the idea of that one final spot just for you. But you know, not where you happen to hit the ground. <laughs> Suppose I could have burned them to start. That's awful. My father was cremated. Didn't seem so bad. But I guess I didn't want to let him go like that. See? So is that... Would you want that? I'm right where I belong. You? My dad says whoever buries their family will be haunted by them. <clears throat> Maybe that's why I asked you to bring them here. Wanted to haunt you. Maybe it'd be best we turned in. Every night I heard about the world that withholds from us. And that we should deny it just as it has denied us. Why did he even ask me to bury him? He never asked me. Maybe because you want to help. But he knows Henry. What did he do? Doesn't seem one much for forgiveness. No, we believe only in absolution. And that's awful. What do you want to hear, kid? I don't know that I'm not giving my father to my enemy. That I'm not crazy. Everyone lets go different. If you don't want to be here, you can go back to dragging around the corpse, terrified of letting go. But trust me, you'll have to stare in the eye sometime or another. I usually tell folks to sleep however they do when they're not here, but head upstairs. Get some rest. I don't want to be in any trouble. I'm not tired. Go ahead. End scene.